Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. This is Ravi and I am going to explain you today clinical cells topic 42 that is what is the page break, how to use this page break in PROC report. You know most of the programmers are facing this problem while handling the page break in outputs like tables, listings, figure. So today I am going to explain you what is the simple technique to handle this page nation number and uh, how to you know uh, cut the pages you know according to the data and represent the output in the appropriated way see here this is the one of the output you can check whether all the outputs you know data was printed in the accurate way or not we'll check like this if you are you know creating the rtf files and you can see here the page number page 39 of 39 you should you know, uh, you know compare with the below one of the MS word if it is 39 39 and it is a 39 so all the data was populated in all the pages if it is you know around 100 and it is around 55 60 year, means some pages are skipping or some the data was not printed in all the pages so we can check all the pages and we can handle the exact page nation uh, you know some pages are or, or data was not printed or printed we need to check so here you can see this is one type of data this is a lab data and here you can see the second subject having two two records for each and every parameter one record belongs to the screening and the recording belongs to the follow-up this is saline normal transferase aspirated see all these parameters are showing in the data how to represent this data in the listing here you can see if you are the if you are breaking each and every parameter break after parameter if any parameter any variable are using in the break statement it should be in the either order either in the group statement then only it is going to break in that manner otherwise it will throw an error it is not in the defined appropriate way so whenever you want to break any variable so that should be in the group or order statement okay so defined paramen and this is defined parameter paramen by page so if you see here each and every parameter that will goes to page so the first subject the second subject you know you can see aline and transferase are printed in the first page and aspirated amino transferase printed in the second page if you are breaking the parameter wise each and every subject parameter wise it is breaking we are applying the page back statement otherwise if you are breaking visit wise for example define visit in the order and if you are breaking the visit wise here you can see the first subject the parameter align and transferase was printed in two pages because we are breaking visit wise so screening was printed in the first pre first page and follow up was printed in the second page so if you are breaking visit wise the pages was you know break by the visit wise in the each and every subject e individual parameter so if you are giving like you know all the pages are 1 and LNT equal to 1 for example if you are giving page equal to 1 for all the records and the, you are defining that page is to order and if you are breaking that page by page each and every page if you are breaking this page because this is a unique this is a one number to all the records if you are breaking in this manner you can see all the parameters are continuously printed in the page wise 1 2 3 they can uh, you know printed in the page wise but what happened the problem is if you see here some after printing this first page the second page was printed without the subject number because the subject number was continuously printing so that was not you know we are not handling in the page wise manner in the data so it was printed like you know how the subjects are there it was printed s2 s3 s4 in that way that was printed and in the second page if you see there is no page nation number and if you are uh, digging that outputs and you can find this missing subject number each and every the next page the next page the first page if you find the page uh, subject number but in the second page if you are not finding the page uh, subject number due to this that was continuously printed throughout the pages so this is also not appropriated way so how to handle this page nation number you can see first of all you can select how many you know, observations are fitted for that page 
so approximately around 13 if you find so lnt less than or greater than 13 so we are putting we are cutting the only 13 13 words or 13 rows are printed fitted for this rta file so i am expecting only 13 so app, uh, once the output generation we will check whether it is it should be increase or decrease we can decide this 13 or 15 or 16 or 12 or 10 so we will decide as per this one so approximately the 13 observations imagine that 13 observations are fitted for that page so i am cutting the 13 pages 13 observations and giving the page nation number and break after page okay what happened in the here you can see the 13 observations the page was 0 and next 13 observation it was 1 and next 13 observation it was 2 so we are be breaking this page observations okay so what happened this page observation was printed but even though it was not going in the appropriate way because the potassium first record first visit was printed here and second visit follow up visit was printed here so this is also fine in case some cases because the subject and the test was printed in the second page but even though the quality outputs that they were asking because this is a not appropriate breakage because the subject wise test should be all the visits should be in the one page so the reviewer or the client want to you know checking that outputs in that manner the quality outputs mean this is also fine output in some cases but the quality output should be wherever the visit should not be break in two pages like screening in the first page haul up in the second page so what we have to do is just you can see the 13 words and the first dot paramen if it is a first dot paramen then only we just apply the page nation number either it is a less greater than 13 or first dot paramen the both conditions if you meet then only the pagination number will go into increment cases okay in that case you can see we are giving 13 but it is not a first dot so automatically the 14th number it will goes 0 and 1 2 etc thing so if you see here the potassium the two widgets are populated in this way second page the protein screening onwards and while rubin so the parameter and within the widgets it belongs to that parameter was cutted in the proper way so this is the simple code you can use anywhere this code to handle this one first dot paramen otherwise you, you can increase this number or you can change this variable name I, I am using paramen so if you are using visit and visit num or any other variable this is a condition either you can count the, you can increase or decrease this observation count or you can change this variable name to handle this page nation number for the appropriate output so here i am using paramen if it is related to some other output so choose the appropriate variable to cut the page nation number and print those records in the output in the particular page this issue was you know getting in listing cases if it is a more than thousand or two thousand pages so that time this code was very helpful to you to handle the page nation number page break of the particular output okay use this code and you can print your output so if you want to learn real-time clinical SAS programming so please reach out this below numbers I'm going to give real-time project training related to HDTM Adam and TLF so if you are really interested please enroll you can contact this number for more information okay